I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Betsy Ross, American Revolutionary War Patriot. I take three fingers from the top, in the middle I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a pretty good size oval. Then right about three quarters down I'm going to mimic that line again and draw another curved line. Then I'm going to draw curve line, curve line, curve line, keep going all the way around the space. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, and connect. Right about here, we're just going to draw a slightly curved line up over, down, and connect. I come down here on the left and I draw a straight line down. I come on the right and I draw a straight line down. Come back to the left and let's draw slightly curved line up, connect. On this space right here, I'm just going to draw a big curved line down on the left. Come back up, big curved line down on the right. I come over to the left and I'm just going to draw a slightly wavy line up, over, and down. I come down to the middle point right about here and I'm just going to draw another slightly wavy line out, down, connect. Now I'm going to draw curve line one, two, curve line one, two, curve line one, Two, curve line one, two, curve line, connect. In the space right here, we're going to try and draw five point star. Straight line up, down, out, in, out, up. Left side, straight line out, in, down, up, connect. Let's see how many we can fit. Straight line up, down, out, in, down up, come on the left, straight line out, in, down, up, connect, one more, straight line up, down, out, in, down, up, come on the left, straight line out, in, down, up, connect. Okay, starting right here, we're just going to draw a curve line down on the left, curve line down on the right, and we're just going to draw another curved line, connect. Okay, come inside this space. One curved line, two curved lines. Come over here, curved line, curved line, connect. Curved line, curved line, connect. Little curved line inside on the left. Little curved line inside on the right. In the center, straight diagonal, curved line, curved line leave it floating, come down here on the left, put a dot, curve line up, down, up, down, over, come back over here and let's just draw a slightly curved line up, connect. Okay, let's see how we are going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to work down here on my flag, that's what this represents. And I do red, white, leave it alone, red, A, B, A, B pattern, white, red, and you will color this in way better than I am. Move over, red, jump over, red. Then, using my blue, I'm going to try and color around the shapes we just drew down here. It's a little tight, but you can do it. Jump over. Jump over. Don't forget that little space at the bottom. 
jump over. Okay, so there's Betsy Ross, and there is her flag. All right, this space right here, I'm going to do green, just for a pop of color. Then, if you have multicultural crayons, you can color in this space, this space, and this space. I think this is in this space. This is an apricot or peach. Then I'm going to take my brown. I'm going to color in her eyes. This is brown. This is brown. All the way down. And it looks like I forgot my pink, but luckily I have my red, so I'm going to lightly color this space red. Okay? Then I'm taking my yellow and I'm just going to color in straight lines for another pop of color all the way across. And we'll talk in just a minute about Betsy Ross. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here's Betsy Ross all colored in. Supposedly she was part of the crew that ended up making flags for the Continental Army. She made many wartime contributions and is an American Revolutionary Patriot. Okay, bye-bye.